Welcome back in the storm threats going to be done by 8 p.m. and you'll be able to sleep easy tonight knowing there is nothing bad weather wise to worry about. This cold front's going to bring an end to our rain and thunderstorm chances right now. We don't even have any storms period, let alone severe weather. The nearest lightning strikes are near Columbus down towards Cincinnati where southern Ohio still lit up with thunderstorms. Right now it is just some April showers impacting our viewing area from Toledo and Monroe all the way down to upper Sandusky where the a little steadier south of the Maumee River. Locations like Hancock County, Crawford County getting dumped on right now, and even up towards Bowling Green, the rain is still steady. As far as the Toledo Metro, well, keep the umbrella handy, but the rain is a little bit on the lighter side, and roadways may be damp this evening. Looking out at the 475 24 split, you are seeing a few raindrops on the camera, perhaps headed to Waterville this evening. Heading home from work, you are going to encounter a little bit of light rain. The bigger picture, we did have some thunderstorms some of which were severe that rolled through earlier today, and we picked up a strong wind report at Toledo Express Airport of 51 miles an hour. Right now, the nearest severe weather is in Cincinnati, and actually looking to the south of the state line in Kentucky, there are those severe thunderstorm warnings. Now, our watch has been expired. That means the severe threat is dwindling down and is just about zero. Still some severe thunderstorm watches in eastern Ohio, but overall the storm threat is just about done for the night. Let me show you here on the hour by hour forecast. Those rain and embedded thunderstorms are going to move off to the I-71 corridor in eastern Ohio. And by sunset, here's what radar is going to look like. We will be much more clear. Still a few lingering showers as a cold front passes. Our WTOL 11 weather app shows you some of those scattered showers as possible through the evening, but there's not going to be any weather worries by the time you go to bed tonight. Tomorrow's weather is going to be quite a bit calmer. It's still going to be a little overcast and cool when you wake up, but by the afternoon sunshine returns. Temperatures top out in the mid 50s with a few glimpses of afternoon sunshine to look forward to on your Thursday. The weekend is looking spectacular as good as it gets for April. High temperatures up in the 60s, and that'll also give the ground and the soil a chance to dry things out after this wet start to April weekend forecast. Still a little cooler, but still pleasant on Saturday. If you're a fan of the milder weather, you're going to love the looks of Sunday. That'll bring us high temperatures up in the low to mid 60s. All right, if you want it even warmer yet, I've got some good news in that 10 day forecast. Temperatures surging to the 70s, possibly even reaching the upper 70s to near 80 degrees. Quite the flip in the weather pattern as we welcome back a warm spring field and abundant sunny weather with largely dry conditions. Our alert day is going to wind down by sunset tonight. It is going to turn a little bit breezy and cooler behind that front. The wind turns calmer on Friday, both weekend days featuring sunny skies and the warmer of the two. That'll be Sunday with temperatures up in the 60s. By Monday, we'll be in the upper 60s, hitting that 70 degree mark Tuesday and warm is the the best way to describe this weather. We are going to be potentially near record temperatures. You'll see those upper 70s to near 80 degrees by the end of the 10 day forecast. And overall, it's going to be a very dry stretch of weather. After a rainy start to April, we get a break from those April showers. Dan, Melissa. I did take your advice today. Uh, we talked yesterday yeah. about taking a nice walk late morning. Yeah. My wife and I went out there. It was, it was beautiful. Warm. And you would like the humidity, what? too. We yeah. haven't felt that muggy setting in a while. We officially hit 79 today. So close to wow. the record. But yeah, almost 80 degrees. Big fan. Yeah, big fan. Almost <laughs> felt like summer. Thanks so much, John.